Hello everybody, <clears throat> this is Racing Bra Nick. I'm here again, it's the third video and we're going to try today something really really new. Uh, there are going to be way more emotions than, than before. Um, I have asked uh, some of you about, about your opinion about the videos and most of you uh, said that it's rather, I don't know, a passive uh, commentary and it's not that interesting, it's not that much of, a, of an action. And actually I tried to, um, to be a little bit more crazy during the, um, during the races, making more, more tries and overtakes. Actually I, I had to pay for this one because I'm uh, emotionally uh i don't know i i don't want to say not very stable but you know when you're in the mix of of a fight and there are many things going all the time going around and then sometimes you just um, probably you just push a little bit too much i guess so today we're trying something a little bit different unfortunately i managed to show two minutes 10 seconds and uh, something using the wheel uh, when on my gamepad on the controller I was able to show 2090 which is actually a pretty pretty nice time but um, yeah we will have to uh, learn again to play this game using the wheel and it takes time so here we go uh, we are starting from the second position the first guy is from Bahrain I think or from Malta I'm not sure uh what the f this this flag is but this guy is obviously very quick and we are not even thinking about fighting the guy at least i didn't think about this before we started um after first couple of corners i felt like actually it it it's kind of okay we are going to follow the guy but uh, again, emotions, the same story, I pushed a little bit too much and you are just about to see what's gonna happen. Uh, I'm going to make a mistake and then I'm going to fight until the rest of the race with the other guys who are right now behind me and the first guy is just going to to disappear literally. So here we go, uh, this is the first lap and here we go, I'm making a horrible mistake. Uh, it, it's not that horrible, but I lost quite a lot of time uh, Immediately losing two positions, but I decided to fight back the third guy and he, he decided not to leave me any space uh, Yes, we touched but I, I don't think that it's uh, uh, Like it's on me. I think we we should share this one. Yes, I was a little bit too aggressive But uh, this guy didn't leave me any space. He was expecting me just to <laughs> drop back and just do nothing literally so now we're in a position three and we're getting a little kick from behind but it's um it's for now it's okay we're going to follow the spaniard trying to overtake this guy and getting back our second position but still we are in a rather uh, calm lobby uh, i should say these guys are not that crazy quick the second race will be a way way more difficult but let's see what what's going to happen uh the guy in front of us makes a little mistake i'm trying to use this moment and this fuck fucking cone just on our way and we're losing the momentum and there is no way to overtake the guy i i decided to take this um this line to have maximum speed on the on the straight because uh, as you know alpha is not that quick and anyway you you saw everything that happened that the tt is just crazy crazy fast on the straight and we just lost another position and now we are fourth uh, and thinking about how we are going to fight back these guys as you can see through this s section we are way quicker than our opponents uh, but unfortunately we couldn't make a lot out of it and we stay just behind the German guy um, For now it's the guys behind are 
yeah on, on a reasonable distance eight tenths is is okay here we are trying to be very very ca cautious not to make the mistake of the first lap but the spanish guy makes he makes a mistake and now we are getting a chance to overtake the spanish guy we're taking the white line but it, it's it was incredibly clean thanks very much for this thing Spanish guy because I wasn't expecting this thing I was expecting actually I just hit from um, from from my left side and just to go wide but it's another thing that you have to also try to uh, to rely on your opponents and not to be too conservative expecting them to to mess your race up the Spanish guy made makes a mistake and he goes really wide and this is our third position we're gaining back and now we are starting to to go after the German guy uh, from now on we are just fast forwarding a little bit because um, we are trying to make some time and then we will see what's gonna happen then the guy behind is a little bit too slow he drops back and like nothing is happening behind we are still trying to catch this guy but uh, as i said on the wheel i feel i still feel very uncomfortable and this is why i i don't really want to push on on the maximum uh just avoiding any mistakes through the s section again we are gaining some time as you can see uh now this this very very tricky corner here where we made a mistake we go a little bit too wide and losing a little bit of time here i was trying to get the maximum speed out of this corner to follow the guy but as you can see tt is incredibly fast he just made two tenths of a second during this little uh, little section i make a little mistake and uh, at this point i thought that all my hopes for the second position are lost because we're going to start the fourth lap and basically there is no chance to do anything about about this gap thank god this cone is already away but yeah i in the last video i already said that i'm planning to turn the cones uh, again off because i'm not using them on my other account where i drive using the controller but here still i need this thing somehow it feels a little bit safer but um i have to i have to stop using this thing because these cones are just insane sometimes they are just on your way and there is nothing you can do by the way uh, you probably might see these um, two pretty qu uh, pretty quick corners i thought that i'm making a mistake but actually it was the best the best section like i gained like half a second on the guy in front of me but it was kind of dirty with a little bit of drift and um and I touched the grass so uh, it doesn't count but it, it was actually pretty nice I saw many top guys doing this move and they're winning crazy amount of, of time there so anyway this is uh, the um, the first race we're going to finish third we tried we tried our best uh, but we couldn't succeed uh, catching the German guy uh, so at the third third position we're happy about this we are gaining our points slowly very very slowly but what can we do we have to train we have to fight again and again and i i'm not willing to just to sell the wheel and <laughs> just keep playing on the controller because it's way more fun playing on the wheel so yeah this was the first race we're going to start the second one the lobby is completely different uh it's um like there are a lot of a guys um and we're going to start i think eighth or ninth or somewhere there uh and it's going to be a very very hard one i actually i i think i'm messing up there again and like the whole race going going wrong and like there there will be a lot of emotions there actually so I'm saying thank you very much for the race. It was nice and we're going to for to try the second one. Yeah, we're starting ninth. I know the guy who's in right in front of us, Nico Run 974. This guy is from France. We have driven against this guy already a couple of times. Other guys, I'm not sure I have seen them, but it's it's always the first time. As you can see pole position is 2.89 so actually it's more or less where we could be using the controller 
I have 2090 my time on the controller. Um, so yeah, here we go. Uh, a little bit of warm up before the race and we're just jumping to it. Um, I, I'm sending these videos in, in different groups asking you about your opinion and I'm going to ask now again. Please, if you are watching this video, please leave in the comments your opinion about the sound, about the format, about the voice, about the language, about what, what do you think about this. It could be really, really helpful to uh, make things more interesting and more exciting for you and of course for me because I'm very motivated to to bring the channel on uh, on a different level and to make it really interesting for you and just actually fighting for it. So here we go. We are starting the race. Actually, I, I don't know why are we fast forwarding it because I I did the the video this morning and uh, eight hours later I am uh, preparing the audio. So here we go. Um, the first lap we are closing to the guy in front the gap behind is is pretty big so we are kind of calm trying to to close the gap and try different things on, on uh, during this race so let's go here is my favorite corner as you're going to see you see this grass you see this slide and we are losing it. I'm hitting the wall and losing like huge amount of positions. I think like one, two, three. Yes, this is a slow mo. Look at this thing. The first one was actually fine. Maybe just a little tiny bit too fast. You see, I'm on the full throttle. It was a little bit too optimistic. I tried to do the, the move that I did in the last video and I just over driven the car and I'm sliding going right outside and here you see I'm touching just a little bit this this uh, sand or I don't know what that is and again I'm pushing the throttle I was hoping that I'm going to escape but we couldn't I hit the car actually it's game over <laughs> if it would be real racing it would be very very uh, I don't know, annoying actually on the first lap to do this kind of thing, but uh, what can we do? We lost two positions, only two positions by the way, not not more for this mistake. I, I could have gone way, way uh, below where we currently are and we are going to fight again this Brit pretty much until the end of the race. So let's see what's gonna happen. Uh, it's going to be a very, very cool battle. Um, the Brit makes a little mistake. We are closing on him. He is driving also the Alpha 4C. It's a very nice car around here. Uh, it feels a little bit, uh, a little bit too slow on the straights. But but if you drive nicely uh, during the S sections, uh, you are going to gain your time back. Uh, so we are in the middle already of the fight. The guys behind are four and a half seconds uh, behind the guy in front just makes another mistakes and another one and another one letting us get right to their back and try to fight for the, uh, for the position actually in the in the beginning it was kind of clean but then this guy just I don't know he provoked me or I don't know by the way tell me your your opinion about what what is going to happen because I find it a little bit dirty what happened uh, I mean, maybe maybe my my kind of standard is too high for what I'm expecting, but but still, we almost get a perfect um, perfect run to this straight, and we just lost a little bit of time touching the grass, but we're still there. We're right behind the guy. I thought that I'm going to pressurize him until he makes a mistake, and then we would try to make a move. He was making them, but they were not that bad, so we 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 couldn't uh, capitalize on that. So here we go. The f I think it's going to be like the first first attempt. Uh, we're right behind. No, 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 no. It's it's going to be. I think it's going to be on on the la next lap. I'm lifting off a little bit just to to avoid any any problems uh, in this corner because like after using the strips uh, slipstream we are just a little bit faster 
and it could be dangerous so I left off and here just a little slide and we're losing the guy so we're fast forwarding again because I have to gain all the time to get back and then to 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 try to fight to fight again by the way the ninth position position is not that far away and we might think about ninth too at least I thought in the middle of the race here we go one guy makes it the Spaniard makes a mistake and we're going for a crazy move outside here and we are going to make the move although we try <laughs> we touch just a little bit the grass there and the the move worked I was very happy and very proud of this move because it was uh, I felt at least it was it was very dangerous we are on the back of the breed again making the same mistake unfortunately I'm going a little bit too early all the time on the throttle and just losing the momentum and losing the uh, the possibility to to fight for the for the ninth position and here we go now is our best try where go he goes to the inside we're going to the outside and I thought that we are compromising just a little bit his uh, line and here I'm lifting off expecting him to make a mistake but he was very very cautious he braked and he went on it was a perfect defense from from uh, from the Brit and on top of it we're going to lose the position to the Spaniard I literally overslept this this thing and I was so upset with myself uh, the radar was turned on I didn't do anything I didn't look back I was expecting this guy to be way far behind and we're losing this position and what to say we have to fight again for our 10th position now which was uh, very frustrating another first uh, another moment to to be frustrated and the emotions are getting higher and higher in this race so we're going to see what's going to happen it's the final lap we're just behind the, the spanish guy i'm lifting all the time because uh, these guys are pretty slow in this section and but i i, I can I, I literally cannot overtake this this moment i don't know you you judge me what, what happened i think like the nose of the car was there and I was expecting to get just a little bit more space I left off I braked a little bit harder than than usually to to be sure that I'm going to be completely on the inside of uh, of this turn but uh, you you saw you can you can get back there and and look at this and tell me what you think about this this moment for the fourth time we're trying to get the perfect exit and we're finally getting it and look at this shit the Englishman just comes back after making a horrible mistake just on my line stopping me I I don't know what do you think about this but I would never do this after making mistake he's obviously way slower than us I would leave the guy go because it, he, he was so slow he would lose uh, his position and then he would he would lose a lot of time during this uh, this trade but he went back there he blocked me I don't I don't find it in any way just normal or good I mean we are s rated uh, drivers and this is what I'm not expecting to see from you I am giving him a little push here and then trying to go back here and I'm oh my god this was just disgusting because I was so rage I am missing my break point I'm going out of the track and this was it this was the end of the story I'm losing all the positions everything that we fight f fought for and we're going to finish the race on the p14 penultimate position but i don't know what to say you you share you tell me what you think about these situations i will try to to get better to avoid this um, these collisions i mean uh losing the the breaking point uh it's my mistake but still we made some hundred points being kind of high B level I guess because A starts on 28 29,000 you're going to jump to A but we are slowly getting there we keep being 99 on S so at least the game didn't penalize me for what happened thank God because otherwise it would I, I don't know I would scream 
um, the points are getting there little by little and we hope to see some improvement in the next videos so leave your comments and your thoughts thank you very much for watching see you soon